always have a lot of things to buy but nothing to wear. <laughs> Fashion was the last thing on my mind. It's about expressing yourself. It's fun. I was first introduced to fashion magazine while I was in secondary school. That's where I know all about models. It's like a very far-fetched thing. I never imagined myself as a model. I never see myself as a model candidate. I was busy playing volleyball. <laughs> fashion was the last thing on my mind. I wore the whole cover girl and I think it's a, something like a modeling course as one of the prize. And I was signed into the modeling agency and that's how I started. I was modeling in Taiwan when my mom called me and then she said there's a executive producer from the TV station looking for me and he wanted me to be one of his uh, lead roles in his upcoming serial. So uh, I came back and auditioned and that's how I started and I thought well maybe I just give it a try because I never tried acting before so I thought maybe it's quite fun to do it but I never stopped since. After my first uh, serial then I got another project by another executive producer. That's how I go on and on and on yes and I stopped modeling after that. I don't really see myself as a fashion icon. I just want to be comfortable. I like clothes that are clean um, that matches my lifestyle. On my normal days I like to be comfortable because when I work I have to wear like six inch of heels I need to doll up and stuff like that so when I'm not working I like to be comfortable I base my look on what I like and what is suitable for me but of course a lot depends on my stylist they will do all the homework for me like what is good what is not good and what is nice and what is in this season or what is a must wear this season he has to know my body shape Sometimes because I, I cannot do fittings at all, he just need to have some clothes for me to stand by, like I go straight to work. He needs to know what looks good on me, um, like maybe the colours and also my personality. He, he needs to know that uh, this is fun, this is not so you, maybe not. I knew David Gunn since I started model when, when I'm only like 17. First he took care of my hair, he, he will kind of like um, tell me, oh, uh, you're in this project, maybe you want to do your highlight in this way. After that, he will tell me a lot of, uh, like, how should I dress for certain this occasion or that occasion. My first style award was styled by him, which I love very much. The yellow raincoat, the high cut boots. And that time, in I don't know what to wear for a lot of, a lot of uh, occasion. He will get a lot of things when he travel and say, oh, this is what I get for you, you know, you should wear, it, wear this uh, during when and when and when. Highlights. It has to be my operating gown. <laughs> I still love my wedding gown. Bailey, especially designed my wedding gown. I think I look beautiful. <laughs> I want to thank my stylist for all these years of fashion moments. Vegan, Martin, you know, and all the solids that I wore, like of course, Jeremy, who styled me today. My one and the only interest is Zed. <laughs> okay, okay, and Christopher Lee. <laughs> the only time that um, uh, there's a bit of a change in my wardrobe is because I'm breastfeeding. And when I go out, I try to wear something that is easy for me to breastfeed, Zed. If I wear go go shorts, then Zed will have his go shoes. Then if I wear if I'm in stripe, then Zed will be in stripes as well, something like that. And, or if I'm in denim, then Zed will be in denim too. <laughs> Sometimes I do that. Yes. I'm not really that digital. I still like the old-fashioned way of flipping the fashion magazines. I like to buy a lot of heels, which I never wear on my normal days. I only get to wear it um, during like maybe on stage or. Uh, certain events. I always have a lot of things to buy but nothing to wear. <laughs> I still like the element of risk. I like to be playful. I like to because fashion is all about being playful to, to be able to uh, to try something that you like. You know it's not being about safe. You can call it an art and it's about expressing yourself. It's telling people who you actually are. Yes it's fun. I just have to be me.